bum, 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 bum. New day in Hogwarts. I like the look of that quilt. Ron has got a snazzy fucking quilt. Reminds me of some of the quilts I had as a kid. All warm and snuggly. Oh. Right. What awaits us today? Probably finding those the rest of those goddamn ingredients that I don't want to find. What do you think they're doing? Keeping a thing like that locked up in a school? If any dog needs exercise, that one does. You don't use your eyes, any of you, do you? Didn't you see what it was standing on? Its feet? Floor? I wasn't looking at its feet. I was too busy with its heads. No, not the floor. It was standing on a trap door. It's obviously guarding something. What could possibly need such heavy protection? It's either really valuable, or really dangerous, or both. Well, it's going to have to wait. We're going to be late for charms class. Follow me, Harry. Charms class? Is that, uh, is that the second floor? Charms? I don't know. I don't know where it is. Do, 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 do. Where is everyone else in Gryffindor, by the way? It looks like it's just us three <laughs> that are living in Hogwarts right now. Surely there'd be, I mean, surely there'd be more students in the common room at this time of day, or maybe we're quite late. I don't know. Nintendo. What I do know is I'm grabbing these beans. Oh, bogey. bogey. What I want to know, Harry, is how do you know what bogey f mm, tastes like, eh? Coconut. You've been mining for gold. Thank you, Az. Dirty, dirty little boy. Right. Come on, Harry, follow me. I thought we were following her many. Oh, finally, more students, yay. Nice trade cards with you guys. Don't think so. What about you? Sorry. I, w I want to talk to you. Shouldn't you be in charge by now, Harry? How come everyone knows where the f my timetable better than I do? I think I've mentioned before in a video. I don't know what video it was, but I'm pretty sure I've mentioned it. I have a recurring dream where I'm back in school and I have no idea what lesson I have next and I cannot find my timetable to save my life and I panic and that's the whole dream, basically, is me just not What's knowing where to go. What's a wizard card, Harry? Ooh, yes. Fancy trading wizard cards, Harry? I do. You have no cards to trade. God damn it. I thought I'd have at least one to trade by now. Non magical studies, history of magic. Yeah, it's the second floor. Here we go. So, are we going to learn Wingardium Leviosa today? Can I go in the girls' bathroom? Nope. Oh, God damn it. I have to wait a whole year for that, Harry. Jar. So can I hold Ugh, infinite beans now? Tripe. You'd think so, wouldn't you? You'd think that you wouldn't really have a limit anymore. Let's quickly smash these. Mm, peppermint. Oh, Let's go sprout. back upstairs. Oh Ow. god, I'm nearly dead. Get up. Toss him in. Ah, that's a Wiganwell potion thing, isn't it? Ooh, I am so oh, I'm dead. Oh wait, no, I had two health bars. What? That was my I thought that was Ron's this whole time. He tried to let his mate out then, did you see that? Cheeky little bastard. In you go. And as if by magic. Chest appears. Shut up, you little bastards. Noisy. A wizard card. Carlotta Pinkstone. 1922 to the present. Famous campaigner for lifting the International Confederation of Wizards Statute of Secrecy and telling the non-magical that wizards still exist. 
Miss Pinkstone has been imprisoned several times for her blatant and deliberate use of magic in public places. Damn, bit of a rebel, eh? Wanting to uh, expose the entire wizarding world. Cool. She must be pretty old as well. Um, now, again, I've not seen any of the Fantastic Beasts films. Uh, I don't know if some of these characters perhaps appear in those films. That would be kind of cool. I don't know. I have no idea. But it would be cool to see oh, some of them, possibly. Wax flavor. Can I do anything with this cauldron, or do I need to learn the I need to learn the Wigman World potion still? Okay, when's our next potions class anyway? Because uh, yeah, we will have to grab those ingredients at some point. God, those things are fucking noisy. All right, there's the library. Let's go to charms. Good old Warwick Davis. Oh god. Camera controls. I think Flitwick's teaching us Spongify this morning, Harry. Spongify. Let's go in. Spongify. When did we learn Wingardium Leviosa? Good morning, class. Today's lesson will most assuredly involve learning how to cast the softening charm, Spongify. Once you have managed to collect the Spongify spellbook, the Spongify charm will be yours. You must then return here to the classroom. Okay, looks like uh, pretty standard stuff. Spongify. The softening spell. I wonder if there's a hardening spell as well. Right. Oh. Okay, let's grab this spell, Harry. Wait, is that it? No, that won't be it, surely. Oh, is this just another... Ah, oh, it's another beastie thing. So, we've got fire crabs... I guess just fire crabs. Oh dear, I remember fire crabs. There they would be. Can I get rid of them permanently? No, I think I just stunned them. Alright, so we got some stairs, but is there anything around the base? More fucking fire crabs that are totally dangerous. Don't mess with them. You will get burned. I want to know why I've got two health bars. And when did I get that second health bar? Because I don't remember at all. Alright, where are we now? Oh, in fact, is this the spell book? I think it is. So we now have Spongify. Softening charm, most useful for making things rubbery and bouncy, especially certain hard surfaces. Arr. Once enchanted by the Spongify charm, these surfaces or tiles can propel the caster into the air. Okay, so you make bouncy platforms. Okie dokie. Well, let's get that equipped on circle. Spongify spellbook! Spongify spellbook! Brilliant! Wicked! Anything around here? I wonder if there's going to be any secret doors with uh, Lumos. Some of these kind of look suspicious, but I've only just, I've just got rid of it. Hang on. There we go. Lumos! Oh, there is! There is totally a secret door. I am a genius. Oh, you little fuck. And there's a challenge shield. Get down here, son. Bring him down to my level. Oh god, I forget to get up straight away. Wish I could move the camera better. Grab him. Grab him. Grab him. Thank you. A challenge shield. A challenge shield. Yes. Everybody loves a challenge shield. And health, I'm guessing. A pumpkin pasty. A pumpkin pasty. 
Yeah, we've got two health bars. Pretty cool. I can hear a frog somewhere. I wonder where it is. Is there another door here? Not on that one. Coffee, chocolate frog, motherfucker, yeah, look at that health increase. Oh. What do you do? Oh, those things, right, we've been seeing those in the freaking gardens. Now we can do something with them. How do, what do we do? How do we do, what? Charge it up, maybe? Spongify. There we go. Oh, hey! Oh, I even did the hey, nice. Dun 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 dun. A challenge shield. Yes. Let's see if we can get a good grade on this one. Although it might be like the other one where you have to get other spells and come back later. Uh, what do we do with this block? Just push it. That's awfully simple. <gasps> Harry, no. Get down, you sploob. Just push, push the block, you little fuck. Thank you. And get a bloody haircut, you, eh? God, I remember people telling me that all the time as a kid. Climb the damn thing. My mastery of the controls is unparalleled. I know what you're thinking, guys. It's like, how can Mage possibly control this game any better? I know. The thought frightens me. So does his music. What does that mean? More puzzles? Ooh. More frickin' imps. Ugh, you dirty little dick. Oh, ghosts as well. Why the hell not? Can we have some more fire crabs too? That'd be great. I'm using I'm using the wrong spell wrong spell there. <laughs> I was using the wrong spell. <laughs> Come on, just die. Where's your friend? There we go. No, wrong spell. You can't spongify a ghost. They're pretty soft as, as they are. Lumos! I think it's a, it's a pretty bright idea to use this spell right now, don't, wouldn't you say? <laughs> Sometimes the shittest, most obvious jokes are the... Most shittest and obvious jokes. You little ass biscuit. Where's your friend? Come here, you. All right, over halfway. This music actually reminds me a lot of Baldur's Gate. Oh, fuck. <laughs> too close, Harry, too close. Nearly there, nearly there. I keep on forgetting I can move the right... the, the, the right stick to change the camera. Oh, they've got a midgies widgy worth of health left. Stop you! Why did I? Oh my god! Triangle mage, triangle. All right, simple, simple stuff. Get to bounce up there, and then, oh my god, quite a bit to do still. Is that a ladder in the mid? That is a ladder in the middle, isn't it? Or is that just where the thing climbs, the platform? Right, anyway. Now we press circle. Spongify. Badoing. <sighs> Nearly didn't make it. Please don't kill me. It's in this door. I hear another frog, which I could definitely use. There it is. Right, so we've got another bouncy pad. 
possibly a shield somewhere? I can hear it. A cauldron cake! Cauldron cake! I fucking love cauldron cakes, Harry! Alright, Spongify. Spongify! Four, yes. A challenge shield. How many was there in the last one did we get? We got eight last time, didn't we? And we got a B. Just gotta keep an eye out for him. A wizard card! Mungo Bonham. 1560 to 1659. Famous wizard healer. Founded St. Mungo's Hospital for Magical Ailments and Injuries. Oh, St. Mungo's. Of course, yeah. All right, that's cool. That's a pretty cool one. He seems like a nice guy. Got a very nice uh, bit of facial hair. Right. Let's go back to the main room. Hoping I'm not missing any secret passages with the Lumos spell. I think they do tend to telegraph where they're going to be. They make them sort of obvious, but not... They don't just put them anywhere, I'm hoping. Spinach flavor. Like, I'll try it here, just in case. Lumos. I don't think so. Nope. Just another Spongify. Spongify. Bedoying. And a switch. It spun me right round. The fuck are you doing, Harry? Honestly, he does. He has a death wish. Like Charles Bronson, he's got a death wish. Right. Can we climb up there? No. No, we can't. We must bounce. We must bounce again. Once more. Spongify! Up through the oh, atmosphere. Bogey. Up where the air is clear. Mm, oh god. Peppermint. There's a new Mary Poppins film out, isn't there? Mary Poppins Returns. I'd be curious to see how that is, because I used to watch the original a lot as a kid. And uh, Emily Blunt is actually one of my favourite actresses. Ooh boy. Anyway. Uh... Oh, piss off. Alright, I'm not actually going to bounce up there just yet. I want to see what's going on over here. I'm maybe going to redo my freaking spells game. Uh, I'll get rid of Flipendo for now. That could do with a bit of WD-40. I wonder if all these ghosts are actually ghosts of students that have died trying this challenge. I would not be surprised. Revolting. More beans. Mm. Uh, uh, mm. Uh, uh. Oh gosh, where is this taking me? Fire crab. Oh, and a switch. And a bottomless pit of death. I know what we have to do. We have to get the fire crab to stand on the switch. Which means I'm going to have to freaking change my spell again. Oh my god. How do I get him onto the switch though? Can I push him? Ah, we knocked him back a little bit. But that has done nothing. Come on. How do I... Oh, there's a switch thing there as well. Maybe I should do that. Maybe that's what I need to do. Ah, that thing needs a Lumos. Holy shit, dude. Mother of God. Harry, why did you do that? Oh, you little bitch! Dependo. 
trying to focus on the task at hand here. It's very difficult when I'm being shot up the ass with fire. Especially when the camera doesn't behave. Where, the, where is that statue? You little... Oh, you are getting on my nerves. I can't see where that statue is. Oh, turn around, Harry. Try and have a look. Is it in there? Oh, fucking God knows. What does this switch even do? Oh, there, it's up there. I see it. I see it. Right. You have to do... How can I get up there, though? How do I target it? Lumos! Is that going to do anything? I'm too low down. How can I possibly... Stand here? Harry, you're not targeting anything, buddy. Lumos. I thought it was Lumos you had to use on that thing. Uh, and there's no Spongify thing to bounce up there or anything. And this is just the way back. Oh, I'm very confused. Unless there's something maybe we need to learn. What does that switch do? I've done that one. I have to. I can't kill the fire crab though. I've tried. Dependo. Oh, we knocked him down. Oh, nice. Oh, sweet! There we go! That's what you do. Ooh, things out of the walls. It's like you kill the fire crab. We still got some fire for you, don't worry. Not a problem. We will provide. Okay. No, Harry. That's, the, that's a good lad. That's a good boy. Alright, push it into place. Climb up and Lumos. Lumos. Aha. Alrighty. Making progress. Getting shields, getting cards. I'm guessing that's another card right behind us. A wizard card. Oh, I've got two of him now. 1912 to the present. Et an entire venomous tentacular for a bet and survived, though is still purple. Yep, I remember you. What a dude. What a dude. And we've got two copies, so now we can definitely... Well, we should be able to trade. You'd think. It's going to be in this one. A wizard card! A wizard card! I know, Harry. We know what they look like now. Mirabella Plunkett. 1839 to unknown date. Famous for falling in love with a merman in Loch Lomond while on holiday. When her parents forbade her to marry him, she transfigured herself into a haddock and was never seen again. <laughs> what a fucking nutter. Oh. <laughs> oh, man. Yeah, I've been to Loch Lowland. It's a very nice place. A very nice place. Up in Scotland. Run, Harry. Right, okay. So that was a nice optional room done. Took us a little, little while. Wait a minute. Wait a minute, why can't I go through there? What? 
the hell? How am I supposed to get out? Well, I'm not sure. How do I get out of here? Harry, you big... You... There are no words, Harry. There are no words for your stupidity sometimes. How the fuck do I get out of here? What does that switch do? How do I get out? The door, I, I can't open the door. Do I have to use Alahamora again? No. Lumos, is there any secret passageway out of here somewhere? I can't seem to open that door anymore. I just heard of another frog. Is there any way out of here? Where's that frog? There is a frog so close somewhere. Maybe above me? How do I get out? No! I want to go back to the main room. There's still stuff to do. Why can't I go back? Uh, unless there's a, another way to climb up somewhere. Climb, climb it, Harry. Uh, uh. Let's have a look around. I see like a hole in the ceiling. That's where the block came from. How the hell do I get out of here? What if I do Lumos again? Probably not gonna help. Oh wait, it's doing something. We've already done that. We've already seen that. Why are you let me do that again? What is going on? Oh, I just figured it out. I have to move the block on the switch. I just figured it out. Grab the fucking block, Harry, when I tell you to. Not from that fucking angle, though. There we go. That'll do, Donkey, that'll do. Ba -bum, ba -bum, ba -bum, ba -bum, ba -bum, ba -bum, ba -bum. Avoid the fire! Oh god, somehow I did not get burned. And then... Spadonk. Ah. Ooh. God, do I need to find another frog? All right. Now can I leave, please? Yay, right. Okay, what is next on the agenda? You little... Ooh, I hate these ghosts! They're so annoying! And my Lumos doesn't last nearly as long as I need it to. Thank you, Froggy. Yep. Oh man, that is quite a drop if you fall, Harry. Just saying, that is quite a drop. Leave me be! Yeah, there's another Defindo thing up there, I'm guessing. We'll bounce up there, but we won't be able to do anything. You sod off! Yeah, I'm guessing we'll have to come back once we get the Defindo spell. Wherever or whenever that is. Revolting! Vomit is there a secret door here? No. Time to bounce. We gotta bounce, Harry. Time to bounce. Don't know exactly where. Not there, obviously. Not there either. <laughs> hang on, hang on a minute. Where are we going? Where are we going? Oh no, maybe we do go up there. 
Spongify. Grab it, Harry, you mook. Why is he not go why is he not going up there? Oh, maybe there isn't actually anything to do up there. Uh I guess just I don't know. Or I dunno. Wait a minute. What's through this door? I haven't been through this one, have I? Nope. Mm, Revol Revol revolting! Oh god, more fucking divs. Come here, you boogers. Stun you as well. But quick enough, grab a. Oh, kind of a half hearted fucking throw was that, Harry? Oh god damn it. Oh god damn it! Come on, what <laughs> the fucking hell? <laughs> god, these things are annoying. Pick it up. Oh, I can hear more of them. Can I? Or is it just these two? I hope it's just these two. One's more than enough. I know what to do here. Do think those platforms look rather snazzy. Got two more shields. So a grand total of six. Fall down, Harry. Don't fall over, it gets you down. Uh, a, challenge a challenge shield and another switch we need to block somehow. And doors we can't open. Maybe with this switch. Maybe not. Ah, there's one. I see. Kill the frickin' fire crabs. Okay. Dependo. Hopefully they won't hit me from Dependo. here. Come on, charge it up, Harry. Dependo. That's not actually working. Maybe I need to send them over the edge like I did with the other one. Come on. Oh, there he goes. Nice. Dependo. Dependo. Bye bye. I, you know what? I wonder what happens if you're still exactly where the block needs to be. I think maybe it just moves you out of the way. But that'd be funny if you could die. <laughs> Success! You completed the challenge, but now you die. Where it needs to go. Whew, not out of the woods yet. Anything in here? Nope, nothing. Frickin' take that. And back once again to the main room. I reckon we're getting fairly close to finishing this challenge. It's interesting though, uh, the Spongify spell. Not seen that in any of the other games, I don't think. Or at least not in this uh, capacity. So let's go jump on this. Just making sure there's no more secret Move doors. Spongify. Boing. And where are we going to be jumping now? 
Uh, we need to get. We need to light those two torches. Ah, straight ahead. Spongify. There we go. So we're at the very top of the room now. Oh, bogey. Um, what's on the other side? Don't you dare jump down, Harry. I saw what you were trying to do then. Ah, that's the way out. Okay, well, that's fine. We're not going to go there just yet. I'm going to try and get as many of these shields as possible. Is that saying that we couldn't have got across that gap? That totally looked doable. At least to me it did. Leave me be. Yeah, we're definitely going to have to come back to these challenge things with new spells and stuff. But for now, I think that will do. We can go back to the garden with this Spongify spell and see if we can grab some more ingredients. Because I know I've missed some. I, I know I've missed some in that area. I didn't really uh, get to grips with it too much. But I was obviously missing spells, so there we go. Back to class. Nicely done. I give you a C for trying. A C? I have a message from Professor Snape. He wants to remind you all that your next potions lesson is coming up shortly, and there will be house points deducted if any of you forget your ingredients. Oh, God. That is all for today. Class dismissed. I think you've dismissed class already, mate. There's only me here. The Spongify charm is most useful for hard-to-reach areas. Yes. Right, well, Snape can go suck a dick. I... I will try and get those ingredients, obviously. Uh, so I wonder if you can just go straight to to the class without them and just take the hit with the house points. I mean, I'm not going to, but I wonder if, I wonder if you can. What is that? Oh, it's just a bunch of beans fused together that I can't freaking reach now. Fantastic. I've been gypped. Can I grab those at least? Why are all these beans so hard to grab? Revolting! Vomit flavor! I got 66 of them though, that's pretty good. Yeah, I can't I can't get them. Booger. Spinach flavor. Alright. Hey Ron. Harry, you heard what Professor Flitwick said. We'd better get those ingredients of potions. Professor Snape, he doesn't want to teach potions. Everyone knows he's after Quirrell's job. Knows an awful lot about the dark arts, Snape. I'll meet you at Hagrid's. Yeah, he knows a lot about the dark arts, so he must be evil. He must be super evil. Alright, so yeah, we're going to head back down to Hagrid's chaps. Uh, but that's going to wait until next time. Uh, I might do a little bit of research on where to find the next lost item, or un I mean, unless someone wants to tell me in the comments, that would be great. But uh, but yeah, for now, we're going to leave Harry and Ron, and uh, I just hope you enjoyed this video, and, well, this session, because again, it's probably been split up into two. But we got, uh, we got a couple of new spells today. Pretty happy with the progress made, and I can't wait to start the next one, and I hope you join me then. Thanks for watching, everyone. See you next time. This is Snake, telling you to subscribe to Mage Masher 22 on YouTube and Twitch. Snake out.